every time I go to shop for makeup, I get so overwhelmed. There's so many options, every type of product, liquids, creams, blah, blah, blah. Um, okay, and once you pick the makeup, how do you apply it? There are brushes in every shape, blenders. So, honey, I know I'm reading it, but I'll tell you right now, we're overwhelmed. Yes. Right? Yes, she wants to know what to buy. Uh, okay. yes. And this is well, so... I do too. And <laughs> it's in every <laughs> neighborhood, every price yep. point. Every Target, Walmart, yes. and, and not just the big, yes. like huge mm -hmm. stores, yeah. or specific to beauty stores. That's yeah. right. It's everywhere now, everywhere. these huge sections. Yes. And you're like, what? Yes. What is it is, it's everywhere. Do you, you need, for us, please. Okay, so do you need yes. brushes? Because I just use my hands and do this. Is well, that, it's no? very funny, yes. <laughs> as, a, as a makeup artist, yes, I love fingers, but not everybody loves to do that. So, first and foremost, I don't know what kind of skin Denise has, but I do know there are lots of different skin types. There's dry and there's oily. So, let's address the dry skin first. Okay, first and foremost, the reason why foundation goes on funny, if you will, on dry skin is because, hi, it's dry. It also has lots of texture and maybe it doesn't want to penetrate. So first and foremost, you need to use a liquid foundation on a dry skin. It just makes sense, okay? But how you apply it, is important. So first and foremost, I always like to take it, put a little bit on the back of the hand, but let me show you this. This paper towel is going to represent your face. Oh. If it's dry, okay? And what I want you to do is not use a sponge. You wanna know why? Because when you put it on, watch this. You're gonna see, look at that. As you put it on with the sponge, you see how with the dots here, it's showing that you and are not like getting colors. it all yeah. over your skin. And yes, it's yeah, many different and colors. And it's many different colors. You got it, you got it. And, and Mally, do you recommend the primer for dry skin too? Yes, always okay. using a primer, okay? So now let's talk about a liquid with a brush, okay? Dr. Jen needs a brush. <laughs> all right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this and because you have the bristles, watch this as you buff it into the skin hello you are seeing how it's filling in the pores and wow. you're getting it and you can really work it into the skin let it become part of the skin and it looks very natural so that's how you do no sponge use a brush or your fingers right that's okay. Okay. okay so you're not wrong. now let's talk about oily skin that's where the greasy grapefruits come to town. <laughs> oh my god okay so these greasy grapefruits are your oily face okay <laughs> and what you want to make sure you use is a powder foundation why and the reason we did citrus is because it's porous and it's uneven just like our skin okay so here's the reason why you don't want to use a liquid on an already greasy surface, right? You're gonna put it on oh, and look, oh. I know. Oh. Already everybody's like, blah, in my it's face. It's like an oil slick. It it's is, horrible. and it doesn't try, it doesn't go on nicely. It travels, it moves. You moves. Can, moves everywhere. And also, guys, it kind of congeals and it's just nasty, okay? <laughs> so what you wanna use is, hello a powder foundation. The reason why is because you're gonna use this beautiful sponge and you're going to do a different application. I don't want you to like just rub it all over your face. You have to be strategic with it. So you're gonna take it and you're gonna kind of press and roll. Look at that. So, yes, and see how nice and light it is. Because this is the thing, guys. You don't necessarily want to have a whole bunch of makeup on in one fell swoop. You wanna do nice, thin layers, get your coverage where you need it. Remember, foundation is not necessarily wall-to-wall -wall carpeting, guys. Put it only <laughs> where you need it, okay? And use your powder, use your sponge. Oh, one more quick tip. Use a little, if you wanna really get into those little cracks and yeah, crevices, yeah. make a little taco with your sponge. Uh, I love a little taco action and get it all where you need it. <laughs>